In our morning rounds, hooked on fish oil. It's one of the top nutritional supplements sold in the United States. But a new study is raising questions about the oil safety, including its impact on cancer patients having chemotherapy. Our Dr. David Agus leads the Westside Cancer Center at the University of Southern California and joins us from Los Angeles. So what does this mean, David, that if you're, on, if you're taking chemotherapy, you can't take fish oil? Where is this coming from? Well, a group in Amsterdam and Japan showed that a particular fatty acid that's found in fish can block chemotherapy by almost 50%. So then they gave fish oil capsules and mackerel and herring to patients, normal patients, and showed that they can get levels in the blood that were the same that could inhibit a mice. Now, nobody could do the experiment of giving fish oil capsules to people getting chemotherapy. It's unethical, right? If I have something that I think may inhibit chemo, that study will never been done. So when there's never been shown a benefit to patients with cancer of fish oil capsules and there's a potential negative, patients should right now avoid it. What are you advising your patients? What are you doing? On my patients, I'm telling them, I want you to eat real food. Mm -hmm. I want you not to take fish oil capsules mm -hmm. and avoid the mackerel and the herring, which have the highest amounts of this particular fatty acid. Mm -hmm. And doctor, what about fish oil capsules o overall? Well, you know, it was a nice piece in the New York Times earlier this week that there have been about two dozen studies with fish oil capsules over the last decade or so. And early on, there was a little bit of benefit in some of the studies, but all the recent studies have shown no benefit. And I think that's because cancer, I mean, heart disease care has gotten much better. And people thought fish oil capsules could prevent heart disease, cancer, et cetera, but the data don't support it. You know, if you're a fisherman and you catch a beautiful fish, you sell it to this uh, fish market for $20, $25 a pound. The rest of the fish you sell to the fish oil company. Which would you rather eat? Eat real food. Uh, doctor, the uh, Council for Responsible Nutrition, which represents the supplement industry, uh, said evaluations by government authorities show it's safe in small daily amounts. You say it doesn't help. Can it hurt? Well, there's that one example we gave of the patients getting chemotherapy. In other individuals, there's clear side effects. There was one study that showed a potential increase in prostate cancer, and other studies show that gastric upset, diarrhea, bloating, et cetera, from taking these capsules. So in general, up to three grams a day is probably safe. But again, I'd push people to eat real food instead of the pills. Dr. Agus, thank you very much this morning. Thank you.